Korean scientists have made a breakthrough that could completely change how we power our devices. And if successful, we could soon live in a world where charging your phone takes seconds and battery replacements become a thing of the past. At the Korea Institute of Science and Technology, a team of researchers has developed a new kind of supercapacitor that fixes the limitations of current energy storage technologies. They have come up with supercapacitors that can charge in seconds and last hundreds of thousands of cycles. And this is how it works. The new technology uses a special composite material made of single-walled carbon nanotubes and a conductive polymer called polyaniline. This combination offers the structural strength and conductivity of carbon nanotubes and the energy storing capability of the polymer. This design improves the durability and speed of charging, and it also boosts how much energy the supercapacitor can actually hold. That means you can have a battery that can charge quickly and stays running for longer without draining too quickly like what we have now. So the way traditional supercapacitors store energy is by separating ions across two plates immersed in an electrolyte, which allows for incredibly fast charge and discharge rates. But without any chemical reactions, their ability to hold energy has always been limited. By integrating the conductive polymer into a carbon nanotube framework, the researchers have managed to increase the storage capacity while preserving the supercapacitor's ultra-fast performance and resilience. So far, these batteries have survived over 100,000 charge-to-charge cycles without significant degradation. It's also mechanically flexible, which means it can be folded, rolled, or bent, making it ideal for wearable electronics, foldable phones, and even next-generation electric vehicles. The researchers have already started producing film-like structures using this material, pointing toward commercial viability. The manufacturing process has been simplified and made more cost-effective, which is often the biggest hurdle when moving from the lab to the market. If scaled properly, this supercapacitor could be used in everything from smartphones to EVs, replacing batteries as we know them. Dr. Bonchao Ku, one of the lead scientists on the project, says the team will continue refining and industrializing these carbon nanotube-based fibers. This development could be the beginning of the end for traditional lithium-ion batteries, ushering in a new era of fast-charging, ultra-durable energy systems.